I present to you zero. It's the new build 6.6. .6. As you see, I have the new logo. Here, all C C2 informations. Many options as you see. I have I have the center clock. I have the network speed. I have a blue color around the the percentage. There we have the notification, quick settings, navigation bar. You have the Pi here. As you see, the pie. I don't use it, so I will disable. Allo. I don't know why they are removing Allo from the KitKat ROMs. I like this feature. It's a small feature. It occupies like 15-20 RAM, but it's nice. You have the installer here, Omni switch, power menu, navigation bar, lock screen, active display, who kernel tweaker, wake lock blocker, animation control, MISC options. App Cycle Bar, Add Blocker, which is nice. You can disable all ads if you don't like. I normally don't use it, but It's it's nice to have. You have the download center, pair gaps, team blackout, exposed. I don't use exposed also. It seems to be a headache on KitKat ROMs. Some models just don't work good. And system app remover, one of the best things this ROM have. You have the performance here, normal, teams are working fine also, I don't have any problem on applying the teams, you see, I have my, my own teams buy, I buy these teams, yeah it's super nice. As you see here, I have a Paul kernel. Then you can install Apollo Configurator GB Jelly Bean, but it works here. As you see, the backlight are working. See? notifications are working and I need this feature so I install a poll now I'm gonna reboot and to show him the new boot animation which is awesome just wait this boot animation 
is made for X HDP devices, but it works on Agate Bay devices like S2. Just see with animation. There it is. New boot animation. Amazing work. If you want to install it, just do like I will show you here. Use Explorer, like Root Explorer or similar. Go to System, Media, and delete your default boot animation. Delete. Just be sure the permissions are right. Then you download this. You can find it on my blog or in Google Plus from CROM. You have a file there. Just put it in your SD card and after you delete the default boot animation, you just copy to here and give these permissions. like this put ok out and reboot you have the boot 